Right, so I shall try a little very unprofessional review of the action cam that I've just received, um, which is a, made by a company called Object. Um, it claims to be 10 H, uh, 1080p HD, whether it is or not, I don't know. Um, it cost me all of £10, so really not expecting much. Um, not really receive much. Um, first of all, very cheaply made, um, which you'd expect. I mean, the buttons are loose. Um, screen on the back is actually really good. Uh, bigger and better and clearer than the uh, camera and video on, on which is uh, an SJ4000 circa eight to ten years ago um, so that's what I'm recording on now and that is what the sound's coming through if the sound comes through at all um, I'm actually using it's in a waterproof case at the moment but with the back open so hopefully picking something up um, I actually purchased it um, for the accessories because I thought well ten pounds can't really go wrong um, and it hasn't upset me with that because I haven't really. I mean, because now I've got a spare battery to fit in in that. Now, the battery, though, is a hell of a lot lighter than the battery I got from my SJ cam, which says to me it's got less in it. Now it charges, it fires up, and it, it, it works. So so that's not, not too bad, is it? Um, T t to be honest, I um, no cut. So I'll have a look, quick look at the accessories that come with it because some uh, action cams and they're all very generic. I mean, to be honest, this action cam is a an absolute clone copy. Uh, got to say, probably same moulds etc. as the SJ cam using cheaper material and, and buttons and, and the like. Uh, it comes with, obviously the camera, it comes with a waterproof case like this. This is actually from the SJ cam. Uh, the waterproof case that I'm filming using at the moment, because uh, I haven't got a tripod, is the one from the object um, kit. The buttons are actually a hell of a lot better, well, smoother than, than on this one. Whether that means they're less waterproof, I don't know, but I'm not going to test it underwater anyway. Um, the It comes with a, a bicycle clip um, accessory, so it goes on your handlebars. I'm actually going to try it and see whether it fits, and don't see why it wouldn't, whether it'll fit on my um, seat post on my mountain bike. Uh, I'm planning to do some filming uh, with that. I, wa I want. Uh, I'm going to have one. I made up this this kit, so it strapped to my uh, chest cam, and I'd, I'd, I think I'd use this with the SJ cam, and because I know that gets decent footage, not after it, anything cin you know, cinematic. I haven't got the time or inclination for that. When I'm riding, I'm riding, and that's that's what I want to do. Um, uh, so it com comes with that. I think that will, will work. Did already have, have one of those. Also comes with the uh, the mount with the uh, small, um, I think it's quarter inch uh, tripod accessory. I've actually got an idea for that. I'm going to have a little handle. Uh, I mean, to be honest, I'm only doing all this because I'm on lockdown with the coronavirus and bored out of my mind. But I always find other people's interview. Uh, sorry. Uh, reviews useful even if not well edited like this will be also comes with a uh, another mount like that which is kind of uh, 90 degrees would you say that I wouldn't know how I'd use this to be honest but hey you, you've got it also comes and in fact I should I should have used this um, for recording because I would have got better sound uh, which is a kind of complete open back with the uh, uh, with with the mounts for the um, ooh that's what I'm going to use that for 
that's that's a better idea. So I can because I was thinking how, how am I going to use that uh, because I'm not really going to mount it to my uh, camera tripod because I've got a decent camera. Anyhow, there, there's my solution. Uh, also a lead which you will have a million and one of. Uh, that's about it. I did mention the case that I'm using. Now one thing I've noticed straight away is the field of view. Now it says a wide angle and 120 uh, degrees. This SJ cam I believe is, is supposed to be 140. Now it's twice as much so I've got, I've got no way of measuring it but um, it's it, it certainly makes it less usable for an action cam but again it's ten pounds this is to me the the camera itself was kind of sacrificial um, we're still going to see if we can mount it to the uh, uh, to the seat post see if that works um, in fact, I'll probably mount it to the seat post on the friend's bike because I'm always at the back. Uh, I'm not going to bother going through all the um, um, the menu because it's it's very generic. Um, it's, it's the same um, uh, things that you can do on on any of these cheap cams. Uh, now the problem with buying, uh, and I've been researching. Um, these, these cams, um, these action cameras. Recently, you can you can buy them from ten pounds, like I have, up to you know four hundred pounds, GoPro, that type of thing. Uh, and and there's all the Chinese copies now. I know SJ Cam is a Chinese copy ish, but my experience with that for the last ten years, it's been great. Now I'd love to upgrade. Uh, and I know things things move on, um, but I think it's still worth if you want a decent one. Forty, fifty pounds. Um, it, it depends what you want this for. Um, like I say, it can be sacrificial. Um, so one thing that is really actually quite good with it is the size of the uh, screen, which um, is say maybe an inch and a half or something like that or it might even be two inches the one on the uh, the SJ cam that I'm using is, is much smaller and worse resolution but obviously that doesn't correlate with with what you output I've done a bit of filming it's reasonable you know it's it's not your mobile phone um, but you, you put this in places where you wouldn't put your mobile phone and plus mobile phones are bulky and delicate um, so yeah it, it's worth it for £10 but don't expect much um, and I, 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 the problem I had was you can buy these £10 I keep saying £10, £10, £10 um, you can buy them £20 you can buy them 30 now if you've received this one or it's clone it's copy it's it's brother from the same factory you'd be gutted I, I think I'd be really annoyed um, but for me it's it's okay so we shall see I, I will see if I can put some um, uh, some of the footage in that I, I'll, I'll do but um, my editing skills are zero, so it'll be the first time I use any editing. So we'll, we shall see. If I do, if I do, I do. Just know that it, it's like your first generation of uh, camera phone. Maybe maybe second generation. It isn't isn't awful. And like I say, I will be using it um, maybe as a rear camera on, on my bike or on, on my friend's bike. So we shall see. Okay, a little test was this is with the object cam. Uh, looking outside, there's not a lot to look at. I'm hoping this this is going to work because this is the third time I've tried it and I've had a couple of blank um, 
films when I've tried to import it into the editing to add it. Whether it's that first time it was a pull card, second time hadn't formatted the card and used it for another camera, whether that is it. Now if this doesn't work I shall give up and uh, say the camera's a bit hit and miss with filming. But uh, it did play on the uh, on the little um, screen at the back and if you notice it is not a wide angle at all. So that it can be problematic for an action cam.